speaker for this special event, a friend of the country and of the ANC for many, many years. Uh, he's accompanying the president now as they walk to the main front door of the church. They will soon be going into the church, and as we heard earlier, there will then be a process that will start, that will culminate with the lighting of the centenary torch, which will then play an important role in all activities through to him, Reverend Jesse Jackson, and of course the, uh, the, the guest of honor as such tonight, the President of South Africa, Jacob Zuma. Now they're walking down the aisle of this renovated church. As I said, last year was the major renovation, a lot later to become the African National Congress. There we see President Zuma with Archbishop Desmond Tutu walking across. <laughs> reflect God's presence for all God's people has now restored this building to what it was of dedication and restoration man and thereafter the presiding bishop concluded we also give glory and thanks to God for the presidents who are still alive who some of them are here with us tonight Nelson Kholishasha Mandela, we won't sing Amen. Tabo Mvuyelwa Begi. Jacob Gedeishekisa Zuma. Would you like to come and take a picture with the president after this? Lit the candle to mark the hundred years of the existence of this great movement, the African National Congress. The apartheid is not over. The skin layer is over, but there are layers deeper than skin. The agri agricultural apartheid, the manufacturing apartheid, the uh, banking apartheid, the Shipping apartheid. The, the layers beneath uh, the skin color are now uh, the next century's challenge. Freedom to equality, equal justice. Because the previous hundred years were spent using majority resources to enhance a minority. Yeah. 